Aquarius, welcome to your weekly forecast for 17th to 24th of September. So let's take a look what's going to be coming your way, okay? Think about a fire sign that is distant from you. Let's take a look at your finances. Seems like this week is going to be really lucky for you. Mm -mm -mm. Somebody from the past communicating. Plus a job opportunity, financial opportunity, whether it's for full-time or part-time. But good news coming your way. Balancing things out. Thinking about that person who still holds the key to your heart, which is a younger earth sign. And... Thinking about... Reunitement. Or reconciliation. You are going to be very fertile this week. So if you're thinking about making a baby, then this is really the right week for you. Uh, just be very careful with nausea and going to high places. Because I feel like this week, you are going to be a little bit, you know, dizzy. Okay, Aquarius, there's this person that you're still thinking about, you know, that is far apart from you, <clears throat> or who lives at a distance with you, and this person is also getting more information or trying to gain information about your whereabouts, so it seems like the two of you are, you know, mentally connected, and whatever you do, this person is also doing, because you're also trying to get the uh, the information, or you're trying to get to know what is this person doing right now, and the other person is also thinking or doing about the same thing. Now, you feel so sad, and you feel just a little bit lonely when it comes to your romantic life. Okay, because you're thinking about the brand new beginning and brand new start, yet something seems so off and something's just quite missing, which is an inspiration. Now, there is an air sign woman that you've been thinking about, and you're also thinking about whether if you can either get the financial help or financial assistance, but you're kind of afraid that this person have already cut you off and not really willing to talk to you. Okay, so you will be scraping out this person out of your list and you will start considering other people as well or <clears throat> you will start um, enlisting some of the, uh, you know, potential people who is more likely to help you out without any hesitance or without any um, grievances. Now, you will also hear from a mother figure or from somebody who's all the 
like a mother figure older than you and an air sign most likely and somebody that you've been waiting to hear or longing to to see or looking forward to meet again but it seems like there are some things that you need to prioritize first before paying attention to this person or to this woman okay lastly you will be focusing on your work and in your projects rather than the romantic side of your life because if you like this is not really necessary at this point because you are just um, starting your new life, new chapter, and new beginning, and you don't really have time over dramas, okay? Now, when it comes to your finances, it seems like there will be some good news that's going to be coming your way, and a person from the past will be getting in touch with you about a potential project, and you will be so happy because you're, you're not really expecting this, but you feel so blessed that just as when you need help, or when you're thinking about somebody who could help you it always comes on time now there's also an earth sign person who is well versed or let's say well connected or expert in this particular field and the two of you will be talking about a potential partnership but you're not really gonna like the terms that she will be um, presenting you another is well, again, about a relationship, this is not really what on the top of your list, okay? Um, so even if there is already a potential of being near to the person that you really want to be with at this point, you want to, let's say, eliminate the idea, okay? And you don't really want to think about this thing because there are a lot of targets, things, aims, and you are targeting for more higher leverage rather than being a lovesick puppy and end up with nothing okay because definitely you don't want to end up in the street without nothing or without anything now you are balancing your life right now you're still thinking about this earth sign person that is younger than you that still holds the key and you want to be cozy with this person okay even though that this person is such a womanizer or a player whether it's a man or a woman this person still you know this is the one that's still reigning in your heart and you can't really give your heart out your affection your love your care and your life to somebody else because even though this person is such a bad news it just seems so odd that this person always get get through to you and always get into your head and you can't really replace him or her now even though that there's already somebody better and ideal that's been offering you their devotion their life their love and everything you're still thinking about this person and you're just wondering what is it that we have in connection that i can't really sever the ties with this earth sign now now even though that you want to give this other person a chance you feel like you can only give your 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 body but not your entire being okay so you feel so sorry for this other person that's been trying to offer to offer their love and ah, love and devotion you know <clears throat> now for aquarian women if you're thinking about having a family or conceiving, this is a perfect time for you because you will be so fertile during this month. Uh, sorry, during this week. Okay, just be very careful in high places because you will be nauseous, and there is a possibility of you slipping off and falling from a high place or high level. Okay. For some reason, you will also have some problems balancing and you will be so sensitive with strong winds or cold wind okay you just need to ask for the guidance of your angels and i feel like you're not going to be that harmed because some there is a spirit guide that will be um catching you if ever that happens now also be careful with bone fracture um now when it comes to your love oracle you need to balance your relationship okay Be especially when there's just too much codependency you know that you deserve love 
but when there's just too much of it and too much clinginess and attention neediness and stuff like that it's no longer healthy you need to talk to your partner that they need to um, get a hold of themselves and they have to you know distract themselves go out and have some fun with their friends instead of focusing too much on you and over obsessing over your relationship because this is no longer healthy <clears throat> Now, when it comes to your oracle cards, you're asking love about a lot of things. It's like there are a lot of things that's also po uh, puzzling you, but you can't really get the right answer. You can reach far, and you will you will reach far. You will go the distance as long as you will keep your priorities straight, and as long as you will just keep your focus, okay? There are some people, things, situations, and places that you have to leave behind, and you need to say goodbye or even shut the door. Okay, so that you can have a better life and you can fully move on. So, okay, that's it for you for this week, Aquarius. And if you want to have your own personalized readings, go and visit me at my website at saviangel.net. Blessings to you.